Thanks, Trisha. That's right. I'm here with Brian from Double Diamond. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. How are you today? I'm excellent this morning. Good. It's yeah. another gorgeous day in the mountains. Yeah, it's going to be another bluebird day, it looks like, out and, there. And I think most people are going to be stopping by Double Diamond to get yeah. some sort of gear. Yeah, absolutely. And I uh, wanted to bring out a, uh, a kid ski. You know, I feel like a lot of the kids kind of get forgotten. They get pushed into, hey, we'll just rent some skis. But uh, we do carry a... Why? Yeah. Why would you rent when you could buy? When you could hey. buy, yeah, and have your own ski for your, uh, for your little guy. But... Really cool thing on this one, K2 Shredder Ski. It is a twin tip, so a lot of the kids tend to kind of like the twin tip skis. 85 millimeters at the waist, so still big enough to handle all that push around snow, any that new snow that we get. But um, the really cool thing on this ski that we really like is the bindings adjustable to a kid's boot or an adult lug. So typically when we move okay. from a, a child's boot to an adult boot, we have to take a different binding. But this marker binding uh, can actually accommodate both and actually can fit up to a size U.S. men's eight, which is pretty oh, cool. Wow. So if the kids' okay. feet are keep on growing, you can adjust the binding accordingly. Also, for people that have multiple children, you know, I have a couple, yeah. but there's a lot of people who come out here skiing. We see families of four, five, six, seven people where they've got five kids. Yeah. You know, does this work for a girl or a boy? I mean, yeah. it's just a child ski, It's a correct? unisex ski, yeah. So how nice with this adjustable binding that you can really make it work for, you could buy it with the first one and yep. just keep passing it down. And keep passing it down, and, and the binding's adjustable, so it can fit any size boot, which and is it, great. And, of course, we can bring it back. You guys can get it all cleaned up, Absolutely. get them waxed, sharpened, everything yeah. we need to do over there yep we have a full uh tuning shop in there we got a brand new machine this year so Ooh. pumping out really good tunes new stone on there doing edge waxes grinding p-tex the whole nine yards uh anybody's looking to get their skis tuned up or anything we definitely uh do a full line of tuning so perfect now yeah. i'm gonna trade you yeah here because what i like to say is hey ladies hey ladies we can't forget the ladies I love this ski from Head. This is the Super Joy. You know, with conditions the way they've been the last few days, we hadn't had any new snow. The snow tends to be a little bit more firmer. Mm -hmm. So we're going to a little bit narrower waisted ski, and obviously it's going to be able to turn a little bit easier. Um, but on this ski, they're using a material called graphene, so it has the same strength as steel, but it's half the weight. Right. So they lay it up in the resin in the ski, and it goes full tip to tail. Then the uh, top sheet goes on that we see here. This is an integrated binding system, so it's the only binding that can go on here. But with that being said, this is one of the lightest I setups. I say, it's really, yeah, super really lightweight. Light. <clears throat> one of the lightest setups on the market right now, and that's kind of the new trend with a lot of the lady skis. We want to keep it nice and light, not keep the legs wearing down, but still make the ski torsionally stiff to handle some of that harder, firmer conditions that we've been and seeing out there. And for those few ladies that actually have to still carry their own skis, yeah. it makes it easier for them. It to does get make it easier. Yeah, I know a lot of the ladies. Oh, they're tired of picking them up, but um, definitely on the lighter side and a really fun ski. It's got a lot of shape and side cut. It's got a 10 meter radius on it. So when we talk about the wow. radius, you know, the lower the number, the tighter the turn. So at 10 meters, it's really kind of what we call super turny. Really easy to Lovely. initiate the turn. A little bit of rocker up there to help start the turn a little bit sooner wood core in here so a lot of fun um, it, and it's good right. kind of a cruiser it's, ski it's yeah. supposed to be fun out there so Absolutely. why not make it easy on yourself now tell me is this just aesthetics or is there some nope kind of this is actually so uh it does keep the uh swing weight of the ski lightens it up a little bit but okay. they also made it so you can put climbing skins on this as well oh, so there's a little little niche on the, on the tail right there and on the tip, but uh, yeah, if you were doing any uh, skinning in this thing, you could do that as well. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, no Love worries. seeing you. You know what? Get out there today. It's going to be a bluebird day, and stop by Double Diamond on your way. They've got great stuff for you, and if you're planning on not being up on the mountain, don't worry. They've got a full shoe store as well, so we hope to see you in Double Diamond soon. Thanks again, Brian. Yeah, great welcome. to see you. Yeah. We'll be right back with more Good Morning Vale.